Hello. This is my little project I had going of Web IO Pi on the Raspberry Pi. Here's the little web interface I made. So simple. A few little temp just the temperature, a couple of buttons. This is the board that I built. If we can go up enough. As you can see, we've got an extension lead here. That goes off to just a plug down there. That powers it. And you've got the Raspberry Pi power supply going to there. Little breadboard here containing, if I can get in the right angle of that, a little temperature sensor circuit running from the Raspberry Pi GPIO ports. And also from the GPIO ports is the relay module. This is designed for, I don't know how many amps, but let's say home electric or small appliances, not like kettles or anything like lights, fans, etc. An extension lead here. All that happens here is this comes from the extension lead and the uh, earth and ground are connected just directly directly and then the live runs off around here and into the ports of the relays and these relays are when they're not when they're not powered they're off so you can see this this wire here leads down to a fan down there which is off and I have another lead running around there which goes up to a fan up there. Don't mind the fog, it's been there ever since I've been in this room. <clears throat> and all this can be controlled from over any sort of tablet that supports JavaScript. So I click this, and as you can see, the fan is now on. I can do that. And the fan turns itself off again. I also have it on my desktop PC as well. Which works a little bit better, a bit faster than Android, apart from my one anyway. Yeah, that's about it really. Hope you enjoyed that. Please comment. And if you need, want any help or any questions, just leave a comment down below and I'll probably get back to you. I don't know.